Okay, today we are in a 2018 expedition working with Sync 3 again. Uh, we get a lot of questions at the dealership on the difference between the built in Wi Fi in Sync 3 and the hotspot ability of the new cars with Sync 3. So, if you look at the top right corner of your screens and you see this Wi Fi signal, that's letting you know that there's a Wi Fi connection in range of the car. So, if you click on this, it's going to take you to the Wi Fi and hotspot section. If you go to Wi-Fi, Wi-Fi is turned on, and you're gonna see available network. So if you're in your driveway, you click here, you'll find your home Wi-Fi network. Once you connect to that with your password, that's gonna allow you to do updates wirelessly, so the car doesn't have to be on. When the car's in your driveway, it'll update by itself when Sync has an update. The difference though with Hotspot is, that's making the car a hotspot to connect, uh, to connect things too, your phone, a laptop, they're two separate things. So if we go back into that section again, either through here or through the top corner, vehicle hotspot is a different option. If we turn that on, that's going to allow the car to become a hotspot so you can connect devices to the car. So there is a free trial that comes with certain vehicles with Ford. So you'll get a, a few months trial and a certain amount of, um, a certain amount of usage free and then you can buy the subscription to it if you want to keep using it. So we'll turn on Wi-Fi, we'll go to the settings, and that's going to give you your hotspot. You see the LTE will come up in the corner, showing you that the car is now into a hotspot mode. And then you'll be able to view your password, put it into your device, and now the car has become a hotspot and you can use your devices on the car.